Well, here's a question for you. You played with Barry. You watched the game today. To me, Barry's the best player I've ever seen in my lifetime. I saw Willie Mays, but toward the end. But Barry could do it all. He could run, hit, steal. Um, but who, when you watch Shohei versus Bonds, who do you think, forget the, whatever you, the steroid, whatever, all that, just what, what they did on the on the field, who do you think will go down as having the better career? Oh, Barry. No one's going to touch Barry's numbers. I don't Nobody, think so either. No, I mean, Shohei's doing some pretty crazy things, as is Aaron Judge. But no, nobody will touch. No, nobody. Res- I mean, there's respect there with those players. You can tell. Obviously, you can't make mistakes. And but Barry would get Barry would. I mean, those guys will never walk as much as Barry did. <laughs> there's just not as much fear. Right. And, you know, because you, you you throw the ball over the plate, Barry was going to hit it out at, the, at one point in his career. That's how good he was. So, oh, yeah. Yeah, no, nobody's my... ever going to be that good and be that intimidating and be that big of a force in the lineup ever. Yeah, I, I, I don't think so. Yeah, I mean, I I don't I can't think of a player that, you know, as I saw that was ever just that intimidating was you didn't want to miss his at bats. And speaking of that, you know, we know the Giants missed out on Shohei. I never expected him to have a shot at him this past offseason. No, but, not no one did. Yeah. But you got one big free agent coming this year, and that's Juan Soto. My thing is with Juan Soto, I says I think the only way you can get a Juan Soto is if you're drastically higher than the rest of the market. It's only I way. mean, I mean, I'm talking probably a hundred million more yep. than what the next closest team is willing to pay. Only chance. Only yep. chance. If they were able to do that, that changes the franchise the course of the franchise immediately because see, I have been a, I love Matt Chapman's game. I love his defense. I love his base running. I love the fact that he plays every day. He's a leader. I have been a little bit critical of his hitting in clutch situations. And uh, he's never been a big, you know, RBI guy. The most he's ever had is 91. But right now Matt Chapman is expected to carry this team you know, as the, as the leader, as the, as the guy, if you surround him with Soto and a, and a Vladdy Guerrero, now Matt Chapman becomes very, very valuable in my opinion, because he's not expected to carry the club. Mm-hmm. You put, uh, you make a trade for Vladdy Guerrero at first base, you sign Juan Soto, you maybe go get a Hassan Kim and, now you've got Ramos and, and Jung Hu Lee coming back and Tyler Fitzgerald and Chapman and all. Now you're talking a team. I would love to see that happen, but I don't, I'm not going to count on it. I, I will be shocked if they get Soto. I think mm-hmm. he lands in one of the New York teams is yeah. my best guess. Yeah. But what's the mindset? Is there any, like in the organization says, you know, we've, we've missed out on judge. We've missed out on Otani. We missed out on Harper. Are they going to learn from any of that and say, we can't be near, you know, we can't be like, Oh, we matched, you know, we matched for yeah. Otani. Yeah. No, you, you're not getting these guys. If you don't match, you've got to overpay. Yeah. That's your only shot. I mean, it's, it obviously it's, comes down to ownership and what they're willing to do. I mean, that's, I don't have any answers to that because mm. like, I don't really know what they're willing to spend. You know? Yeah. It, it, so it's, that, it's, it's, it's just, it's, yeah, obviously that, that, that sounds great. I would love to see that too. Yeah. I just don't, I don't, I, I think that's kind of a unrealistic expectation, you know, unfortunately. Yeah. I mean, I mean, Hassan Kim's not, but you know, this kid Sasaki, the pitcher, I don't think that's unrealistic. Oh, the um, one that's coming out of Japan, yeah. Yeah, um, but I think Soto's unrealistic. I mean, trading for Vladdy—that's that's a different that's a different story, you know. Yeah, Pete Alonso. I mean, I I don't know. I, I they got to make it. They got to make. They got to make. They got to do something. They got to make a splash. You know, they got to get a. They got to get a middle of the lineup guy. You have to. Yeah. I just that's. I think that's the only way. 